working of a computer. Lofty goal. In this lesson, you will learn about the various input-output devices of computers. Hey, Mindy, do you remember what an IPO cycle is? Yes, it is how a computer works, takes input, does processing and produces output. Let us begin with an example. Do you know how a sandwich is made? Step 1. Input. Collect bread slices and butter. Step 2. Process. Apply butter on one side of bread slices. Step 3. Output. Buttered sandwich is ready to eat. Similarly, a computer works through these three simple steps. This process is called the IPO cycle. That is, input, process, output. Input. Whatever goes into the computer is called the input. We use the following main devices to input data. Mouse, keyboard, scanner, joystick, microphone. Some more. Data refers to a collection of numbers, characters, images or information. Mouse. Mouse is an input device. It is used to give commands to the computer. It inputs data in many ways. A single click selects an item. Double clicking an item opens a program. You can drag an icon by moving the mouse with the left button pressed. Releasing the button drops the icon being dragged. You can draw a picture by pressing its buttons. Hey mighty! The keys on the keyboard are not in alphabetical order. Oh yes! The arrangement of keys is based on QWERTY, which makes typing easier. Keyboard Keyboard is an important input device. It is used to enter data and commands into the computer. The different types of keys on the keyboard are Alphabet keys from A to Z Number keys from 0 to 9 Function keys from F1 to F12 Punctuation keys Special keys Shift Control Alt Delete Ints PG up PG down Arrow keys Invention. The QWERTY keyboard was invented by Christopher Scholes, who also invented the typewriter. Scanner. Scanner is a kind of input device that reads text and images printed on paper and saves the information in the computer in the form of an image. Scanners are of two types. Flatbed or simple scanner. Handheld scanner. Hots. Why is a handheld scanner used in shops? Joystick. A joystick is also an input device. It is used to move the cursor position on the screen. Its function is similar to a mouse. It is a stick which has a ball at its lower end. It uses a lever to control the position of the cursor by rolling this ball. Joysticks are used for playing computer games. Microphone A microphone is an input device that allows you to record sound into the computer. Processing Input data is processed in the CPU, Central Processing Unit. CPU is the most important part of a computer. It does all the processing and decision-making in the computer. It also controls all the other parts of the computer system. The CPU can be found inside the CPU box. The CPU consists of three units. Output Output is the result which the computer produces after processing the input data in the CPU. Following are the main output devices. Monitor Printer, 
speaker headphone monitor when you type anything you can see it on the monitor screen monitors are available in various shapes and sizes two types of monitors are displayed below crt cathode ray tube monitor lcd liquid crystal diode monitor printer a printer produces output on paper you can print texts and pictures using a printer a printer can print in black and white as well as in color there are mainly three types of printers dot matrix printer inkjet printer laser printer some more inkjet printers are best for photo printing because of their high picture quality speaker there are usually two speakers attached to a computer these are used to listen to music and all sound output they come in various sizes and shapes headphone a headphone is a device used for listening to music or sound coming from a computer a headphone is used personally where only one person uses it at a time Which one is correct? 